Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Project Ascension. Today we're checking out a fiery paladin build. So this one you're going to rely off mostly paladin abilities with a little twist. Uh, show some skill cards here. We got Flame Strike. That's going to come in handy. Execution Sentence. Uh, and then just some fillers here. Charge and Hamstring for some PvP action. And then Talent Cards. This is going to be the big one here. Explosive Retribution. Your judgments now grant you Fire Starter. Uh, basically, like our last video in the Fire Mage that we had going, this Fire Strike is instant, costs no mana, and 30% more damage. This going to be great for Mana Storms or BGs where you have a lot of people. Uh, and then we have this guy here. Increases your Crit Strike of your Judgments. And then also uh, extra damage with the Seals. And then a whole bunch of stuff there. Judgments of the Pure. Uh, this is going to be a little extra with your seals and your judgments again. And then we also have spell blade, a little extra mana. Uh, we got this guy, just a little bit of a filler, but I figured it'd be nice with the blast wave as well. And then weapon expertise, a little bit of a filler, a little bit of a decent one for any kind of melee build. Um, we started out with Sinister Strike just for an extra ability. We got Judgment of the Light, and then we got Crusader Strike, and then we went with the Seal of Wisdom just to keep our mana topped up. Um, we just hit level 10. Let's see what abilities we got. We'll re-roll for a new spell. Probably just going to get like charge or hamstring. Yeah, I figured. Um, just because that's what we have slotted in. Hopefully we get some of the talents. Oh, we got the spell blade. That's good. All right, that's a good start. Um, we're just going to finish up a couple of these quests here. And then we're going to go do some battlegrounds, level up a little bit. Hopefully we get some good synergy and uh, all the abilities that we're looking for. Alrighty, boys, here we are after about 100 talent rerolls and about 50 fortune uh, skill rerolls. We did end up rolling the fell infused weapon. This does a lot of damage. Um, a couple other little random things here and there. Um, Aspect of the Beast, which is kind of nice. Uh, this Fire Breath. Nothing really too crazy. If you hit this summary here, this will show you everything that you have learned. It's a little bit easier to look at. Um, and then Hemorrhage, we're going to replace Sinister Strike with that. Really not too much. We did get the Seal of Vengeance, so that might be a little bit more damage in that department. And we also got the Kidney Shot. Um, a couple decent talents here and there. Strength, Armor. Um, this overheating is kind of nice. And we also got something else too. Let me find out where it went. Oh, this ain't bad. Fire and Holy Damage stack. You kind of just a lot of mumbo jumbo. But we got a lot that kind of ties into at least something related to either Holy, Fire, Strength, Intellect, something along those departments. Um, and then also... We got a couple pieces of PvP gear. Got some of that going. I was sick with the two-hander. We just have an axe at the moment. Um, I was hoping I got like a, a specialization, like a pole arm or axe or sword or something like that, but we didn't get any of those. But uh, we're going to do some dungeons and some battlegrounds and see how they fare through there. I also want to try some mana storm because of a lot of AoE, that might be a good idea.
Alrighty, boys, here we are. We got a few new abilities. We got this lava lash here. There's lava sweep. Uh, we got this fire breath, execution sentence. A couple little things here and there. There's control blast. There's a nice little AoE. Um, we got this fell fused weapons. Very strong. Battle shot with the buff for the extra strength. Show you here all the different uh, abilities and talents we have here. Um, nothing really too crazy. We got a couple nice things like this overheating, so it kind of plays into the fire pally build. Um, a lot of crit. Um, this is not too bad if you just keep up with it. And then a lot of stuff that we still have to re-roll. We've been re-rolling a lot, and we just haven't really gotten anything good. Um, these seals are nice because I can swap off if I need mana. Um, this vengeance is good as like a single target, and the seal of command is nice because it's a little bit of like an AOE. Uh, we got the aspect of the beast that comes in handy. And other than that, just a couple little things like a couple heals. I got this cool Spartan kick. Um, this is Sparta. A charge, which is great that we got that. And then this Judgment of Light has been the main judgment that we've been using. Um, that's nice because this build is pretty strong AoE wise. I was doing some PvP and it wasn't really too good. I think everyone else just kind of tuned their character way more. Uh, it's kind of just like a basic start and you can tweak it how you like get better rolls and stuff like that um and then also with these i noticed keeping the mana up is nice and then also in general just because i'm kind of paladin based the healing is usually really good i was dueling like two to three people in a battleground at once and not really struggling too much but then you get to like the one person who's just like decked out and you just get obliterated so um as long as you're not getting smashed like crazy you can kind of sustain yourself pretty well so I definitely like that aspect because I hate doing all this damage and just being a glass cannon, especially in something like a battleground. But other than that, it's a pretty fun little class. Good rotation. Uh, just got to pay attention to how many you're fighting if you're fighting only one. The little fire strike isn't really worth it. Uh, if you find a lot of people, then it's usually really good. I get a fire breath there. The disarm comes in handy a lot during the battlegrounds and stuff like that. There we go. Uh, let's see. I would like for them to show exactly where you have to go on the map so they know which uh, direction you should tread. Because some of these maps are just huge. Got him with a little fire strike. Yeah, so we got that there. We got the flame breath. Mop a bunch of people with that, and we also have a controlled blast, which uh, also factors into the fire crits and fire talents that we have here. A uh, little blast wave there. There we go, hit the gong. Alright, so this one I'm going to go with uh, the Seal of Vengeance, because it's a little bit better for a single target. And we'll just kite everybody else down with our fire. Um, I notice also with your execution sentence, when you have it off cooldown, you want to make sure you use that because it increases your judgments. I think I missed my judgment, or maybe I used it already. You see, I don't really have to worry about the rest of the people there. I just uh, cut them down with a flame strike. There we go. Nice. Holy shit. Some judgment leg guards. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Uh, it's PvP or PvE base too. It'd probably be a lot better than what I'm using now. I'm using pretty much all PvP gear. Um, I started out with the set for the Paladin, and then I moved over to this set. Oh, it looks like I just got all the sets now. Um, the set of this the Warrior-ish build, uh, just because the strength was a little bit better, and if I want to build another Warrior, I don't have to worry about swapping a whole new gear set and then also in terms of enchants, I don't really have too many good ones. I just kind of filtered what I had. Went with some stamina, some strength here, a little bit of extra intellect regen, a little bit of crit here just for rogue abilities because uh, for a while I was using the hemorrhage, but I just haven't replaced that one. Uh, this one's pretty good. Extra crit on the judgments. Uh, strength here again. Fire and physical damage, which definitely comes in handy. Fire and uh, nature. So it's not bad when I heal. Um, this guy here, nature, uh, physical and holy. So that comes in handy a lot. This I just haven't even replaced yet, and then we have a little bit of extra rage here. Other than that, I haven't really gotten a lot. Um, let me see, I'll show you everything I have. Because everything kind of just went into either rare or common. I don't really have as much good stuff as I would like. But, still a pretty fun little class here. Uh, the aspect is cool with the flame inversion of like a paladin. Uh, definitely mana storm is going to be good. Dungeons, stuff like that. It wasn't really doing too good in PvP just because I think everyone's kind of just decked out way better than I am, even with all this gear. Um, but either way, it's a pretty cool thing. Check it out if you're interested. Tweak it to your liking. 
And uh, stick around for the next video. Like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.